Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel, and this is another video talking about the next version of Windows 10, version 2004, or what we think will be called the May 2020 update. So, what other new features do we have? Well, there's improvements to the Task Manager. Task Manager is that uh, place where we I go fairly often there for all sorts of reasons, including seeing you know if there's a frozen task, if your computer is running slow, how much CPU or memory you're using, and so on. Well, one of the new features that is interesting in here in the Performance tab is that the uh, there's more information now about different um, hardware, including your GPU. So now your GPU, not only does it have information about the different GPUs and how they're used and the encoding and all of that, but it has even temperature. So here it doesn't show because I'm not using it uh, right now, but usually I will get a temperature reading from my GPU. So for example, when I play a game, I often will see its temperature show up in the uh, GPU here. Also, it will tell you if you're using a regular hard drive or an a, uh, so with HDD or a solid state drive with SSD. So there's more information there also. It can now make a difference between a, a, a solid state drive or a regular hard drive. So uh, that is nice. And reported GPU temperatures is nice for GPUs because when you're gaming, I like to game a lot. For example, I play uh, Halo Reach, for example. Well, you see the temperatures, you know, I, I get readings of 50, 55, 57 degrees. You can kind of keep track of how warm your GPU is getting. And, you know, maybe sometimes having these readings of temperature gives you an idea of, um, you know, maybe you should clean your laptop. Maybe it's uh, a little, uh, you know, uh, there's a little dust accumulating and usually you'll see that in higher temperatures in, in, in its own use. So a few little tweaks, but you know, it's kind of cool to see that they're actually um, having that. And honestly, having the GPU temperature is something I find really, really nice. And of course, having a quick glimpse of, is it a hard drive or solid state drive that you've got is also really nice. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.